What is up guys? Welcome back to another video and this is episode 9 of the Cahaba River series and yet again we have Maddie with us today Hi. and today we're bringing wild turkey for you guys. So here is the game plan. The game plan is we're gonna leave a car right around here, drive up and start the trail. Here I have done uh, wild turkey before and I know that this is probably gonna be the easiest way to ride wild turkey because this is going down the mountain instead of going up in the last bit. So this part's gonna be really fun going down as long as we take it easy, take it nice. Uh, and it, it's a good it's a good bit, it's a good trail. So this is definitely, I've heard it's a little bit more experienced, but it's still good regardless. So as long as you guys try a couple of trails and get a good experience, then you guys are, are totally fine. Obviously, you guys are about to find out, you guys are about to see. But without further ado, let's get started. <clears throat> Pick up the speed. There we go. Yeah, it's gonna get pretty quickly, but you can take it slower. But yeah, we're about to go downhill here in a second. Of vegetation.
Good rot. Java River. Pretty scenery. I'll take it slow here to enjoy the view. There we go. Here, we're gonna make sure we go left because if we keep going straight, we can go into Rust Bucket. And there's a difficult part where you have to cross a creek with some rocks. So once you get to this point, uh, you could keep going straight and then turn left into Wild Turkey again. But in this time, we're just gonna take Wild Turkey on the left and continue on our journey. I'm gonna wait a little bit for for Maddie and. Once I see her catch up, then we can go ahead and go. I'm good. All right, let's go. Mm
I see the truck. Here it is. Woo! We made it. Yeah. Well, all right, guys, that is the Wild Turkey Trail. As you can see, Wild Turkey, about 1.4 miles. That actually went pretty fast. I went pretty quickly. Uh, I love the beginning. It's just downhill and fast. It is a little bit more moderate to a little bit harder um, route at the beginning because you're going fast and trying to avoid sharp turns, sharp, yeah, sharp turns and trees in the way. But other than that, it's really good. I recommend anyone to try it, but at least a little bit of experience. I wouldn't necessarily do this one for your first time. And I would do it starting where we started at the pavilion and coming down here. It's a little bit easier. If you go starting here, uh, at the very end, those sharp, steep hills are gonna get you trying to go up. But if you want a challenge, definitely go for it. But all right, Maddie, what are what are your thoughts on this? Uh, well, it lived up to its name. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the first half before you see the sign for rust bucket in wild turkey and um, It was pretty wild you can go really fast and then on the second half um, It definitely got a little bit more difficult as yeah. a beginner so but um, I think I have decently strong legs so if you think you have strong legs and I think you could do pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> Well, there you have it guys you need them strong legs but all right without further ado let me know what you guys thought about this trail again share it with your friends give it a like and i will see you guys on the next episode peace